game was coming up, away at Mansfield Town, who were going very well at the time. This was going to be the first big test for Argyle since the Luton Town game. Oh, games. This is Pemberton's ball in. Greenacre with the touch and... Well, there was just no pace on it. Once Greenacre got the right boot on it, it was easy for Larrier to save. Had there been more pace in it, then that might well have tested the Frenchman. Steady themselves and Hassel gets out white. Lawrence's cross. This is Greenacre, real chance here. He's blazed it over. Another great opportunity for the man that's already netted ten times for the Stags this season. But he yet again couldn't force Larriot into a decent save. In fact, he couldn't even hit the target this time. Feels for handball from the supporters, not the players, but we'll carry on with Evans. Nice shot on the turn, and it bounced in front of Kevin Pilkington. But the former Manchester United keeper got his body behind the ball, and well, it's a good job he didn't spill it. Brian McGlinchey with the Pilgrims throwing. Phillips back to McGlinchey. Managed just to scoop another cross in, and well, the keeper wanted it leaving, but. Reddington didn't take any chances, it's another corner. And the keeper saves the day there, and Adams' header hits the post. Well, the keeper was still on the floor, and the danger not yet cleared. Frio's shot, and that fades away, but... Well, Pilkington managed to get the first effort cleared, but when Steve Adams sent a header over the top of everybody and that struck the post, and that's desperately unlucky for the Pilgrims. Adams pumps one down, pitch for Evans, who's in on goal here. Great chance for Plymouth. What a finish by Evans! He only needs half a chance. Michael Evans still had plenty of work to do when the ball landed in front of him. The finish was so sublime. It's his third goal of the season. It comes in the 54th minute. It's Mansfield Town nil, Plymouth 1. And it's richly deserved, that lead. Williamson, well, he tries a shot and it hits the post, Larry left it, well that was calamitous, the Frenchman had his arms outstretched and was clearly leaving that one and it struck the post would you believe, I think he's a lucky Frenchman there, this is Les Robinson, 34 year old, started at Mansfield Town in the mid 80s, He's been to lots of other places since. Now, great ball by McGlinchey to Evans, who's picked out Wills, could finish it for Plymouth, round the keeper, and then into the side netting. He just didn't have the energy, I don't think, there, Wills. He run himself into the ground to get into that position. And he's a touch unfortunate. Well, that just strikes Reddington in the forehead and comes out to Stonebridge and it's four on three at the back here. Chance for Worrell to finish it. Great save by the keeper. Frio's finished it off and that's finished Mansfield Town off. It's Plymouth Argyle's first league win at Field Mill since December 1971 and the unbeaten run goes on. You just can't stop them. Four on three. And when one couldn't score, the other one did. 2-0. Frio. There's Weatherick. 
Stonebridge onside, could be three now. Oh, Plymouth are showboating! The third goal comes in stoppage time. A brilliant finish by the former Spurs trainee. Slid it past the keeper with no problems whatsoever. Bradley. Greenacre is back with Shane Bradley. He's missed the target, the former Grecian. He's miskicked a few times this afternoon. Clean through there, no excuses. Should have got the consolation goal for the Stags. Couldn't do it. I did feel that maybe the scoreline flattered us a wee bit today. Though I didn't feel we deserved to lose the game. I think uh, we've dropped back off the pace of it in the second half and allowed them to dictate for long spells. And when you do that, you drag people into your box and they've hit the post at 1-0. They obviously feel agree. 